In today's video, I'm going to talk about the most profitable print-on-demand niches to help you make the most money possible. And guess what? T-shirts aren't on this list. Also, keep watching until the very end because I do have a bonus tip on how you can make even more money with your print-on-demand products. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Caroline and I make videos to help you master your mindset and make money online so that you can build a life you love. If you do enjoy watching videos like this, please take a moment to subscribe and don't forget to click the bell so that you are notified every time I upload a new video. When you think about print on demand, you probably think about printing on t-shirts and that's it. But the reality is there is a huge range of different products available to you for print on demand. Although t-shirts are the most popular product within the print on demand arena, and are usually where people start when they are first diving into print on demand. But the reality is they actually don't really have a great profit margin, especially if you are selling on a third party site, such as Redbubble, Teespring, or Merch by Amazon, rather than your own website or online store. Once all their fees have been taken, you're probably only looking at making around two to $3 profit per product sold. With profit margins like that, how many t-shirts are you going to have to sell to make the kind of money that you want to make. It just doesn't make sense to put in so much work for so little in return. Let's go over what print on demand products can make you double, triple, and even more in profits than what you can get for t-shirts. Number one, jewelry. Jewelry is one of the oldest forms of self-expression and it's one of those products that has a higher perceived value. It's a great print on demand product because people love buying jewelry as gifts and when people buy things as gifts, they're generally willing to pay more than they normally would. In 2018, the US jewelry market was estimated to be worth $279 billion and is expected to increase to $480 billion by 2025. That is just incredible. So why not tap into that demand now? Let's take a quick look at Gearbubble, which is a platform that connects you with print on demand suppliers and then integrates via Gearbubble with the marketplace that you've chosen to sell on. Now I'm only using Gearbubble to show you the possibility of what you could possibly do with print on demand jewelry. I have never used them personally, so I can't vouch for what it's like to work with them. So head over to Gearbubble and click on top sellers. Now there are other products in the top sellers, but there is also a lot of jewelry here. We can see here that the top selling piece of jewelry is a gift from a dad to his son and through the Gearbubble website this product has sold over 25,540 units and it's selling for $27.95. That is over $700,000 just for that one product alone. One of the most popular print on demand jewelry suppliers is Shine On. You can get a very similar looking necklace on Shine On for $9.90. If you are selling a product like this dad to son necklace for $27.95, that's over $18 in profit. As an example, if you wanted to make an extra $1,000 income per month from your print on demand business and you're selling t-shirts through Merch by Amazon, you would need to sell around 350 t-shirts compared with 55 necklaces to make that $1,000. Number two, canvases. Printing art onto canvas is one of those products that can have a really high profit margin, but it has a low base cost. People are willing to pay a lot of money for art for their homes or offices because it's pleasing to the eye. It can inspire creativity in whoever it is that is looking at it. But most importantly, it's an emotional purchase. Artwork invokes people to feel a certain way. And if they like how they feel, then price isn't really a factor when it comes to buying it. Something that is really popular with canvas is that topography type of prints. So artworks that are things like inspirational or motivational quotes and phrases and words. This type of artwork is also great if you aren't a typical artist who would create uh, artwork through paintings or through drawings, that sort of thing. Let's have a look at iCanvas.com to get an idea of what you could possibly create. Now, I'd stay clear of any kind of brand or product names or even famous people as you don't want any issues with copyright, but people love inspirational and motivational quotes. These are all just word-based types of designs, so you can easily create your own in Photoshop or Canva and then have them printed on a canvas. Let's take a look at this music quote print. 
So here we have the 12 by 12 inch canvas for $31.99 and 18 by 18 inch canvas for $43.99, a uh, 26 by 26 inch canvas for $63.99 and a 37 by 37 inch canvas for $107.99. If we take a look over on Printful at their base costs for canvas prints, we can see they don't do the exact same sizes as iCanvas.com, but let's get an idea of what something similar would cost us. Printful do a 12 by 12 canvas, which is $29.95. There is an 18 by 24 inch canvas for $45.95 and a 24 by 36 inch canvas for $65.95. So the potential profit here for you ranges from a couple of dollars right up to $40 profit. Now also I did look at this website a few days ago and the prices were actually a lot higher. So they're currently on sale. So when I looked at this website a few days ago, the potential profit for that larger sized canvas was uh, over $60. If you are already creating designs for print on demand products such as t-shirt, then you could use those same designs and have them printed on canvases. You don't even need to go out and create a whole bunch of new designs. Number three, car seat covers. I bet you never thought about putting your print on demand designs on car seat covers, right? It's a great product because you have car lovers who are extremely passionate and love to spend money on accessories for their vehicle. You can purchase car seat covers from Pillow Profits and have your designs printed on them for a cost of $34.99. Let's head over to Etsy and do a search and see what kinds of designs are selling and for what prices. Now this is showing up in Australian dollars because I'm in Australia, but I'll do the conversion into US dollars. So just like any other print on demand product, you can put any kind of design that you like on car seat covers. Over here on Etsy, they are selling for between 55 and 70 US dollars. This gives you a profit of between 20 and $35 per product. I feel like this would also be a niche that isn't oversaturated. So it could be a really good opportunity to build a dominating brand in this niche. Number four, leggings. Athletic or loungewear, particularly leggings have pretty much become standard dress code these days for anyone wanting to just relax, be comfy, just chill out around the house, or even just getting out and running some errands. A lot of print on demand companies offer leggings as one of their products. And what's great about them is they are one of those products that you can do all over printing on. So with a t-shirt, for example, you have a specific area on the front or the back of the t-shirt to place your design and that's where it gets printed. If your design falls outside of that specific area, then it won't get printed. It'll just get cut off. With leggings, you can create pattern designs or all, all over color designs and it will get printed on the whole garment. They actually print your design on the material before actually cutting out and sewing up the leggings. I've headed over to Redbubble to take a look and see what kind of leggings are available there and how much they sell for. On Redbubble, it looks like prices are around the $45 to $50 mark for leggings. And looking on Printful at the price of their leggings, they will cost you between $25 and $30. Now, Printful isn't the only company to offer print-on-demand leggings. So if you shop around, you might get them for a cheaper price. But just for the sake of this video, that's who I've looked at. So if you are selling your leggings for $50, you are going to be making a $25 to $30 profit. That's pretty exciting. And at this point, the demand for leggings or this type of loungewear isn't going to die down anytime soon. Number five, shoes. This product, I think, is just really exciting because you could just do so much with it, and that's shoes. If you take a look at Pillow Profits, they have a big range of shoes to choose from, from sneakers and boots to thongs and slippers, or flip-flops and slippers. I came across an online store called the Bandana Blanket Company and they sell printed shoes. Now, I'm not sure who originally came up with this design, but it took off and a lot of people have used it. And it's this license plate design with different messages on them. This website is selling the low top sneakers with the license plate designs for $55. Here is another online store selling low tops and sneakers. This site is called Ava Thread and they have a range of different designs on print on demand sneakers and they're selling theirs for $59.95. So back over at Pillow Profits, we'll look at the low top sneakers. They will cost you $31.99. And if you are selling your sneakers for $59.95, that will give you a profit of $27.96 per pair of shoes sold. Also, the thing with Pillow Profits that's really great is that that price that they give you includes the cost of shipping the item to your customer. So if you already charge your customer a shipping fee, that is even more profit going into your pocket. Okay, and for the bonus tip, 
how to make even more profit from your print on demand products. To make an even higher profit on your product, personalize the product. If you can find a way to personalize your products, you'll be able to charge a premium price and make even more profits from your products and make even larger profits from your sales. Firstly, take a look at Godsby Mugs. This is a website that sells personalized mugs. Now, this site isn't actually selling their products at a premium price, in my opinion. Their method seems to be selling a higher quantity rather than getting a higher price. But it's a good site to see ideas for personalizing products. Looking at some of their best selling products, they have over 8,000 reviews. And on their about page, it says that they've had 1 million customers since they opened the online store three years ago. That's just crazy. And it just shows how much people love personalized stuff and personalized products are especially popular as gifts. And again, when people are buying things as gifts, they're willing to pay a higher price than normal. Take a look at these personalized pint glasses from Uncommon Goods. They're selling for $32 per glass because they're personalized. All these personalized socks on Etsy selling for around $25 per pair. Or maybe my favorite is these personalized leggings. Pop the face of your favorite person all over your legs and sell them for $60. And if you remember earlier, we talked about the profit for leggings being around $25 to $30 per product sold. You could get potentially another $10 in profit just by offering personalization. And if you're wondering whether people would even want to buy something like this, well, that Etsy store has had almost 1,300 sales on their personalized products. So there you have five products that aren't t-shirts, which have the potential to make you massive profits in your print on demand business. If you are already selling print on demand t-shirts and I find you are struggling to make the kind of money that you had expected or that you had wanted to make, perhaps it's time to start looking at some other products which will substantially increase your profits. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe.